All right, this is the song, Come Now is the Time to Worship. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to play it in the key of D. So I'm going to put a capo on 2 and use a C shape for the key so that it'll make it in D. So you're going to start with a C. Now, I'm just going to uh, assume that you're, uh, everyone's a beginner, so if you want to skip ahead, skip ahead. But um, if the song starts in C, I don't recommend playing this two, this four finger C that you get taught a lot for worship songs. It works in the key of D, um, but really I think that's about it. I think the, the key of C, you need to play it like a C, a real C. So it looks like this. You got these two fingers on the second and third string and the index finger on the fifth string, the B string. So this is a C. So that's where it starts. Come, now is the time to worship. Now, you can either pick it or strum it fast. But you can't really strum this song slow. It needs to be strummed pretty fast. So um, it's going to go like this. Come, now is the time to worship. Okay. So that F is just, you're just moving those two fingers down one. You're leaving your index finger the same. And you're putting your pinky here. This is F2. And again, this works in the key of C, this F2. But it doesn't work in a lot of songs. Other songs, you need to play the F barred. Okay. But the key of C, it works. So from a C, you're just moving these two fingers down two and putting your pinky down here on the third fret from the capo. That's an F2, and you can hit the bottom five strings. So it's gonna go worship, back to C, and then go to G, come. And you need to play this G, not this G, okay? So you need to learn this G. Okay, come, so you got these two fingers here, your pinky down here again. Now is the time to give, now you need to learn the D minor. Okay, so D minor, Looks like this. You got your pinky on the B string, third fret. You got your middle finger on the G string, second fret, and you got your index finger on the bottom string, the E string. And you're gonna hit the bottom four strings. Let's give your heart back to F. Okay, D minor, F, and back to C for come. Now is the time to worship. Come, now is the, and write to D. Now is the time to give your heart. Come, and then to the chorus, it's going to go to F. One day every time we'll confess. Back to C, sorry. F, C, F, C, F, C for the chorus. It'll go, one day every time we'll confess you are God. One day every knee will bow. Still the greatest treasure remains for the... Actually, you're going to go to A minor right there. Still the greatest treasure remains for those. So the A minor, you got your two fingers on the third and fourth string on the second fret, and you got your index finger on the uh, first fret on the fifth string, the B string. Still the greatest treasure remains for those who will gladly choose you now. Okay? Gladly choose you now to G back to come okay so even if you're gonna go back to the chorus and do it again you need to go to that C and you're gonna go back to F one day every tongue will confess you are God one day every knee will bow still the greatest treasure remains for those A minor who will gladly choose you now back to C for come come okay so I'm going to play it. The chords you may need to learn is the D minor, okay? Um, looks like that. Get my index, my ring finger out of the way. So that's a D minor, okay? And then the F2, which works in a lot of worship songs. All right, so I'm going to play it. So I'm going to play the first time through uh, kind of just picking in, doing kind of chill, and then I'm going to strum in fast the second time. But the slow strum doesn't really work, so you need to play it uh, either fast strum or kind of picking it. G, it's D minor, F, here we go. Come, 
Just as you are to worship Come Just as you are before your God Come One day every tongue will confess you a God One day every knee will bow Still the greatest treasure remains who gladly choose you second time through after doing the chorus, you don't need to go back to that C. So you're on the G, just go right back to the F. One every time. So you don't need to go back to that C if you're going to go straight back into the chorus again. <laughs> 